A non-uniform beam PQ has a mass of 16 kilograms and a length of 8 meters. It rests horizontally on supports P and Q. The reaction at Q is 20 newtons less than the reaction at P. Find the value of R and the center of mass of the beam. So because this beam is non-uniform, the center of mass will not be in the center. We know that this is 8 uh, meters long. If we let the center of mass be x uh, meters away from p, then this distance here is going to be 8 minus x. So for a system to be in equilibrium, we require two things. We, if we resolve in the direction of the forces, the resultant is 0. And if you take moments about any point, the total moment of forces is zero. So resolving vertically, taking upwards is positive. So upwards we got R plus R minus 20, and then downwards we got minus uh, 16 G, which is the uh, weight of the, mat of the uh, beam. So that's going to give that 2R is 20 plus 16G, and therefore R is going to be 10 plus 8G, which gives 88.4 newtons. So this one here is 88.4 newtons, and this is 68.4 newtons, because it's 20 newtons less. Okay, so writing that up. If we now take a moment, so we can take moments about any point, but we're going to take moments about this point here, P, then anti-clockwise... As this one here is going anti-clockwise, we will know its value now. It's going to be 68.4 times 8 is going to be equal to 547.2 newton meters. And then clockwise, we've got this one, so and that's going to be uh, minus 16 gx newton meters. And because it's in... Uh, it is in equilibrium, the total moment of forces about P is zero for equilibrium. So therefore we can say 547.2 minus 16GX is equal to zero. And that will now let me find X. So 16GX is equal to 547.2. So X, if we divide uh, this by 16G, taking G to be 9.8, that will give 3.489 meters which is 3.49 meters. So this distance here, the central mass will act at 3.49, so it'll be perhaps more over here. The center of mass is 3.49 meters from P. So this has been a video to show you how to find a resultant and to find where the center of mass is on a non-uniform rod. I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.